Welcome to the fourth video of the Electrostatics Lab. In this question, we are going to investigate how changing the distance of this wand affects the frequency of sparks produced by this dome. And so there are a couple things and concepts we want you to keep in mind. And the first is dielectric breakdown. Your manual explains it, but I'm going to briefly reiterate that dielectric breakdown is when the electric field strength of a certain area becomes so strong that the air in between two points is ionized. And so this will generate a spark, and that's what we're going to be observing here in this experiment. The second is that, the, of course, the more charge there is at a certain point, the stronger the electric field is uh, in the distance around it or the area around it. Now, these concepts are important to the question that we'll be answering, and that question is, how does the frequency of sparks change as we hold this wand further or closer to the Van de Graaff generator. Now, during the experiment, the procedure will simply be that the crank will be cranked constantly. Keep in mind on what this means in terms of the system. What does this mean? And as uh, the Van de Graaff generator is cranked more and more, we will see sparks occur in between the grounded wand and the dome. And it's your job to, in a given instance, to count how many sparks occur at any given distance. Now, we won't give you a precise distance. We will just be holding at various distances from the dome. And, but it's up to you to record how many sparks occur at each distance. Now, uh, the things that we're keeping constant are the crank rate and the amount of time for each trial. But the distance will be changing in between each trial. So with that being said, we're going to uh, give you the visual of each trial, and you will determine what is happening in between, or what happens to the spark frequency. And of course, the frequency of sparks is how many sparks per unit time. That, that is a frequency. So sparks versus time, basically. So with that being said, I'm going to have Marita join me, and we're going to perform the experiment. So we have our setup here. And I have the grounding wand. And Marita will be helping me crank the Van de Graaff generator at a constant rate. So we're going to do five second intervals and count the number of sparks that happens for each distance. So this is distance one, very close to the dome. All right, distance two, I'm going to hold it a little further. All right. Distance three, even further. And distance four. All right, as you can see, I just discharged that. Uh, to have a safe environment. And so based on your observations here and based on the four distances that I have shown, explained using uh, the concepts that I've mentioned before, uh, why this occurs, and be sure to talk about the constants and the uh, various uh, physical uh, laws at work here. Good luck.